Egyptians believed that uh, dung beetles were scarabs because they appeared from nowhere. Dung beetles barely dung as food for themselves or their larva. Either in barrels dug below the dung mass or by making bowls to be rolled away for burial at a more secluded site. They are day-flying and night-flying species. The latter are not often attracted to light. So the food of dung beetles is dung. The life history of dung beetles. What you look at is eggs are laid singly in brood bowls similar to the one that you are observing or sausages of dung prepared and buried by the female when mature the larva pupates in the remains of the dung supply finally emerging as adults other similar species of beetle to the one that we are watching the one we are watching is a dung beetle it's very similar to the rhinoceros beetle. But the rhinoceros beetle are large and brown, often with conspicuous horns similar to that of a rhinoceros, the mammal, on the head and all authorized. Their larvae are typical white grubs and feed on decaying vegetable matter, commonly in compost heaps. In identification of a dung beetle, one would say it's a robust beetle with rounded backs, shovel shaped heads for cutting out pieces of dung, usually black or brown, some are metallic green depending on the habitat. The tibia of the forelegs are broad and adapted for digging. Most species can fly. Let us enjoy as we watch this little guy bearing is food source under the ground who knows there could be eggs in there and after nine months similar to the human beings small beetles will emerge from the ground just as the ancient egyptians used to say the scarabs those that just appear from nowhere <laughs> There are many, many, many different subspecies of beetle. The tiger beetle, the ground beetle, the chafer beetle, the jewel beetle, the dung beetle. Well, that's just, but not to mention, just a few. And the British pop singing group, the beetles. <laughs> Shows that there are many types of beetles, but not all of them eat dung as a food source. Some eat fruits. Some will eat dead animal remains. Some will go for mineral sap as well as grasses. That just to show so much to learn about these beetles. One. Up and down, shovel in and out like the old miners using a shovel to mine for gold. It's a tough world in the beetle world. 